60 seconds. Right turn. Right. Down two and a half. Forward. Have you ever had one of those moments when suddenly a light bulb seems to come on above your head? And in an instant, you understand something in a way that you never did before. Well, I had. And it totally changed the way I look upon the world. to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard. When I was my son's age, the moon was in the news all the time. 1969, the Apollo moon landing. One small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Here was I, a child of the space age, and I knew absolutely nothing about space. But sometimes one question can lead to another, often to a place you never expected to go. Now, I'm finding it really hard to get my head around the universe with all these huge numbers and enormous distances, and I've got computers, calculators, dictionaries, and encyclopedias to help me. How did ancient man get his head around what the universe was back then? The ancient Greeks, Ptolemy, the Roman Empire, the Dark Ages, Constantinople, the Renaissance. One man, Galileo, took some glass made from sand, ground that glass into lenses and placed those lenses into either end of a wooden tube. Because one day, one man made one giant leap lifted his telescope to the heavens, magnified our vision, and allowed us to fly! Zero. And that was when I asked myself the question that led to my light bulb moment. When the penny dropped and I made my own giant leap. You see, I asked myself, why are we doing what we're doing to the planet? 